Hello there you guys, Crystal here, welcome back to, I was about to say visiting your dream towns just because of what we're about to do today, but welcome back to Rose Wolf, I hope you guys are having an excellent day. It is currently August 23rd, 2017, where did August go? I, I'm serious you guys, where is this year even going? Also, my house looks different. I kind of like it. I think I want to change the roof, but otherwise I'm really kind of liking how it's looking. The white paneling looks fantastic, so I'm happy. Still not sure what I'm going to do for a roof, but I'm sure you guys can help point me in the right direction. Anyways, uh, I woke up very early this morning, got ready for work, had some time left over, so I've actually already done the dailies for today. So I was thinking, you know, what would be kind of nice and relaxing to do? Uh, and then I realized I don't think I've actually- oh hi chef! I don't think I've actually properly shown off the dream suite yet, so that's something that I really do need to do. Um, so for those of you wondering, I can't remember exactly how long it is, but after a little while of playing Isabel, one day will randomly be asleep when you enter your town hall. She'll be sitting behind the desk and she'll just kind of be nodding off. Um, that is when you unlock the public works project for the dream suite, you then have to select it and build it. Um, so obviously we built ours like eons ago and I just haven't really used it other than to upload my personal dream. Um, so I figure why don't we do some dream visiting on uh, on camera. Now I'm a little bit disappointed. I did want to visit a very specific town, but apparently it's gone poof and it's not longer available. Ark is online. <laughs> okay, so uh, for those of you who don't know, ignore the noise by the way, it's just people coming online on my 3DS. Uh, if you lay back here, you'll just get to update your dream. You guys have probably seen me do it quite a few times by now if you've been watching the streams, for example. Um, and then if you lay down here, this is where you actually get the chance to view others' dreams. So this is what we're going to do today. I do need a little bit more sleep. In that case, would you like to take another nap for 500 bells? I need more sleep. I always need more sleep. Okay, so she's just going to connect us to the internet because we have to, I guess travel that way to the other dream. <laughs> um, so what we're gonna do, just because I just feel like showing off the dream suite in general, uh, and I don't really have another town other than the Nintendo town, which is the one I wanted to visit. I don't really have another one like that. Uh, we're just gonna visit my other town, just so you guys can see. Um, so this dream address is available in the description of all of my videos if you're ever interested in seeing this for yourself firsthand. I know many of you have actually already visited, so thank you guys very much. Hopefully I'm typing this incorrectly. That would be embarrassing. <laughs> uh, yeah, it looks about correct. Stream dress leads to the town of Rosewood. Do you want to dream of that town? Yep, I sure do. So a lot of you guys have actually asked me, like, you know, where can I see Rosewood? Um, did you do a series on it? The answer to that is no, I never did a Let's Play on it. It was more so my private town that I used for uh, creating a lot of the guides on this channel. So you guys have seen a lot of the town. It's just I haven't done a full series like I have with Rosewood. Um, but yeah, now's your chance if you haven't already seen it. Although I used to stream it quite a lot. I haven't really been in this town since about July, early July. Um, for me, this town is kind of done. I don't really want to do anything else with it. It just, it's how I want it. <laughs> so um, it's kind of why I haven't been playing with it. Alrighty, here we are. Welcome to the world of dreams. Right now you're having a dream and a sleepy or you were having a dream of a sleepy town called Rosewood. When you want to return to the real world, the world of stress, please lie down on this bed once more. I hope you have the most amazing time here in the dreamy world of Rosewood. Alright, here we are. <laughs> oh gosh, it feels weird being back. Alright, not even sure where to start, but you know what? Let's head up this way, see if we can find myself. Speaking of... Welcome to Rosewood, yep. 
That's what I say at the beginning of uh, most of my videos. <laughs> Here's my house. Looks kind of... Actually, you know what? I did a good job with my current town not making it identical to this one, so I'm not even going to say it looks similar. Alright. First room. I have mentioned that I love the Alpine theme a lot. <laughs> um, I got the Wii U, got the 3DS, got Nintendogs, which by the way, for the record, you get the Nintendogs from the fortune cookies in Timmy and Tommy's store. I cannot count the amount of people who have asked me that, and it's new with the updates, so that's why you didn't get them before. Um, but yeah, they're adorable. I don't know if there's another way to get them, I don't think so, but... They're adorable. These these were gifted to me. I haven't bought fortune cookies in like eons. Now, alrighty, over here we have the kitchen. We have one of my villagers, Cobb. He took forever to leave. I definitely don't want to do my kitchen like this one in Rosewolf. Um, it feels very barren almost it feels um not lively enough i guess so i'm gonna hopefully try and avoid doing that again <laughs> um over here we have i believe this is the bathroom it's been so long <laughs> and this is i think actually my favorite room out of all the ones i did in this house i just like the way it looks i love these cabinets they are my favorite like I guess cabinet or dresser type item. I think they look great. There's another Nintendo dog back there. <laughs> I love it. I love what I did with this room personally. Whose picture is this? Francine. I did have her for a little while in this town. Okay, if we go uh actually, hmm. You know what? Oh wait. No, yes. Downstairs first. We'll do that back room last, I think. Did I move everything down here? I didn't. Good. Okay. Uh, kind of a library study room. I have Annalise's picture right there. Have some fish. All the fish, you guys. If you don't come to the streams, chances are you have no clue what I'm talking about at this point. I'm so sorry. But yeah, I like this room also. It's quite nice. I wish I had found a piece of... Uh, KK's music that I liked for this room, but I never did. Um, I forget what I did upstairs. I think it was the princess theme, but I don't really remember. It is. With a giant Rossetti. Once again, uh, this is from the update. I believe you have to link your happy home designer to your new leaf. Welcome Amiibo. And then once you do that, if you go to the catalog in Timmy and Tommy's store, there will be like a new section for like happy home designer stuff, I think. And there's a lot of giant furniture and he's one of them and you can change his facial expressions and it's beautiful. <laughs> also, blue rose and another pupper. This room's okay. I don't think I got all of the princess furniture though. I kind of ran out of time. <laughs> okay, so we're going to do the back room finally. You guys who have watched the streams probably already know what this room is. <laughs> Those of you who haven't are probably incredibly overwhelmed, and that's okay. Um, so you guys may recognize the Bob room. We're currently kind of making one in Rose Woof right now, although this one kind of is mixed with my streaming setup as well. Um, but yeah, that's essentially it. I was originally going to make Mike here, and uh, that didn't really pan out because I got lazy. I was going to make Luigi also because I love Luigi. <laughs> And yeah, this room was fun. I remember uh, having a lot of fun finding all the different ways, like putting Bob's face in that picture or uh, on the cushion. It's a lot of fun to do silly things like that. Okay, so there's that. 
Let's head back out and just wander around town. I can't really guess villagers like I would normally in an episode of Visiting Bureau Dream Towns because I know all my villagers. But anyway, if you guys could not already tell, Rosewood <laughs> is filled with nothing but roses on the main part, except for here. Ignore this, this is not happening. Um, and then down there, I just kind of stuffed all the other flowers that just kind of, you know, spawned or villagers placed down. You'll see occasional flowers that aren't roses and that's generally because I got lazy and didn't want to tidy up anymore. Um, oh wait! Hmm. When did I save this? Because I think Gala moved out, like, just around the time that I, uh, I was filming the town tour, so that's kind of interesting. And Wendy's still here too. What time? What? what? <laughs> is this not my updated dream town? And Myra's still here. Oh, this is entirely different. This is interesting though. Hi, Myra. But yep, this town looks a little bit different now. That's weird. Hmm. I should probably just check to make sure that... Oh, this isn't right either. Look! For those of you who may have watched that uh, town tour, you would know... I had a Pona right here. And she's not here yet. And Flurry is still here. Oh my goodness. I am so sorry. I need to update my dream town. I took this literally straight from my description, so... This sucks. Also, Nibbles is here. Flurry is there. I think Flurry is wearing my, uh... Simply Press Start logo, which is also my town flag, if you guys didn't notice. As I ran. <laughs> there it is. But yeah, this is this is strange. I haven't even completed this yet. This is work in progress. Dear Lord. <laughs> oh well. But uh, but yeah, it just goes to show you. I need to keep better track of my dream addresses. I keep enough track of your guys's. <laughs> oh wait, is Bob still out of place then? He is. Eventually I moved Bob because he was here, right? This is his house. I moved him out for like a day and then moved him back in right here so that he would line up with Wade. Or not with Wade, sorry, with Cube. Um, that's so strange. I feel like I saved my dream town in one place and then I didn't copy and paste it to all the other places that I store that, that number. <laughs> Oh my goodness, and I think this is, um, Chief? Is Chief still here? This is from, like, April or something then, at least. Maybe April or May? I wish I could tell what time of, like, what month and day it is when I save this, but I don't think you can. Hmm. This is weird. Oh well. <laughs> um, it's kind of interesting to see how much work I put into it just before the uh, the town tour. But yeah, if you guys are interested, there is the non-updated dream address. <laughs> right, I can't go up here at Dream Dreams. I just I completely forgot. That's so strange though. But anyway, yeah, I was using Bob's face for um uh path plot resetting purposes so you'll see his face everywhere <laughs> which is honestly kind of jarring compared to Rose uh, Rose Wolf where I have the clovers which some people complain about others don't seem to mind but yeah this is kind of weird oh gosh there I am creeping I am the Wendell of this dream clearly <laughs> man I miss those shoes I want to buy those shoes again and those jeans I need to get those in this game. Anyway. <laughs> but yeah, that's essentially how the dream towns work. If you don't update it and type in the new address, then you're gonna go to an older version. <laughs> but let's head back.
And alrighty, here we are, back in Rose Wolf, safe and sound. Other crystal didn't uh, follow us back. <laughs> uh, I feel refreshed. I was about to say not really, and then I'm like, oh wait, this is my dream. And there we go. So I, I really like the idea of the dream suite. I think it's a really neat way if maybe you're a bit on the shy side like myself. <laughs> Uh, to visit other people's towns without actually, like, you know, needing to be online at the same time or without, you know, causing any damage. It's it's an interesting idea. Um, now let's see. Everything is pretty much closed right now. But I was thinking we might do some flower arranging just because, uh, kind of like Rosewood, <laughs> things have gotten just a little bit messy in Rosewolf. Which is gonna get really confusing. I am gonna trip up at least once in this video, by the way. And uh, I'm gonna say the wrong, the wrong town, so just bear with me. If I haven't already, that is. Probably have. Um, so I was just kind of putting these down here. I didn't really have much uh, reason for doing so, they just kind of fit. <laughs> Okay, so Melba is chilling out in her house. Let's talk to villagers as well, because I don't feel like I've been doing that enough recently. And they'll be like, oh, I haven't seen you in like a week, but like I play like every other day, so that's, that's kind of bad. Yeah, see, like this. <laughs> Apparently I'm a horrible friend. Oh, right, I picked up a lost item earlier. Maybe this is hers, actually. No, unfortunately. Man, Melba, please just take it. Uh, what's new? I hear you're a bit of a bell pincher. Excuse you. You're the topic of lots of conversation around town. I mean, you know, it would be nice if you guys could appreciate me as your awesome and totally fair and just mayor, but I guess not. Man, I spend so much bells on you guys. <laughs> okay. Uh, not talking to- ooh, that's a large fish. Not talking to Max still. He's gonna be moving out in two days, which reminds me I should probably start doing that raffle for him, but I've been lazy. <laughs> okay, so let's see if I can catch this. I'm probably gonna miss it. No. Oh my god, I was so scared that I was going to scare away this big fish. Oh, we got it. <laughs> Ooh, do I already have you? Nice, we don't. Awesome. Eh, maybe we should work on encyclopedia stuff tonight. I always say that and I never do, so I probably should just continue wandering around and... Uh, maybe run into things that I need. Oh, I should probably take one of these for that other area. Is that something I need? I already have... Is that just an eel? I forget if there's other type of like stringy looking fish that I can catch during uh, August. An eel thing's just got real. That pundo. <laughs> okay. Um, what was I doing? Wandering around. Cleaning up, right? Who has fleas? Gosh darn it. <sighs> Shep. I love you, buddy, but... Oh, Shep. There we go. <laughs> Huh? What's up? You found some fleas on me. Well, now I know why I've been so crazy itchy. Thanks, Crystal. I love you. Why do you not give me a nickname yet? <laughs> what? Are you asking if I'm trying to be a real football pro? No comment. A press conference? Oh, please. Contact my office uh, for those kinds of things. Oh, sorry, Crystal. You caught me in the middle of something. You know, there's absolutely nothing like that in Rosewolf. Or, I know. <laughs> I was just pretending for a laugh. 
Now I feel kind of dumb. Have I mentioned how much I love this dog? <laughs> he is such a silly pupper. Oh, okay, so Shep is obviously not in. We just spoke to him. Peggy is not in either. You know what? Having just visited Rosewood and coming back to Rose Woof, I really like Rose Woof. And I think it's just because I've put a lot more effort into it than I normally would have, just mainly for you guys. And uh, I have a lot of ideas that I wouldn't normally have even thought of, also because of just you guys. So thank you guys very much for this. I really, really enjoy playing in this town. Let's see what we got. A balloon dog lamp. Think we already had it, so that's not really all that exciting. I swear, there's gonna be a tarantula that's gonna spawn here. Just wait, you guys. I am just calling it ahead of time. Oh, hi, Peggy. Oh, no. Eh. I'm, I, I'll get you some. Let me talk to Robin. Meh. Robin. Where's the gang around that I've been talking about you behind your back? Think it's true? Uh, what? Not you. Sarcasm. It's the nicest thing I've heard all day. I can't wait to tell everyone you said that. Okay, so I think she asked for fruit. <laughs> I wasn't reading. <laughs> I was thinking she might suggest a public works project, but she didn't. Oh! Right, I dug up this for you earlier as well. I'm glad I actually spoke to her. <laughs> A wet road sign. <laughs> and there's a letter inside. The plot thickens. And I think it's from me. It's the future me. Why did I want this buried? Well, it looked all worn out, so I thought I could use a spa day underground. Yes, it's silly, but I hope it comes back all refreshed. That's what all this was really about. I can be so silly sometimes. Well, since you helped me with all this nonsense, you should have what you buried for me. I, uh... I mean, thanks? Sometimes my, uh... Oh, there's the other fossil. Uh, sometimes my villagers are really weird. <laughs> There we go. I only found three this morning, so. Also, low key keeping my net on my quick command just in case we run into uh, a nasty, creepy crawly. Which, uh, I think the later in August you go, I feel like the more common they are. I don't know if that's true. I just feel like that's what happens, so. Oh no, Robosy, long time no see. Oh, right, okay. Yes, I haven't spoken to you in a while, have I? The other day, Shep taught me a good trick. If you ever run out of stuff to talk about, just talk about the weather. Yeah, talking about the weather probably won't ruffle anyone's feathers. So I guess that's a pretty good trick. I mean, if you start talking to me about how it's gonna get cold and rainy soon, or snow's gonna start falling soon, uh, I'm, I'm gonna be a little ruffled, not gonna lie. Don't don't like winter. <laughs> don't like the cold. Don't like being wet. Okay. So no villagers were in their houses over there. I feel like we haven't seen many of them tonight, but maybe they're down. Oh, wait, there's one. Wade, what are you doing, buddy? On clear nights like this, I like to just look up at the sky and space out. Sure, I'm tired from all the relaxing I did today. Oh, I've had days like those, buddy. Now let me just grab that, thank you. Snatching flowers from underneath of him. <laughs> oh, uh... I'm gonna, I'm gonna snaggle these too, actually. If my pockets weren't full, maybe I'll come back later. <laughs> 
Okay, let's put uh, these over here like I have been. There we go. At this point, I'm just kind of filling up space, to be honest. I don't think those are actually going to stay there. <laughs> Okay, um, let's see. I'm gonna go have this fossil assessed and also donate this fish to the museum just because I don't want to forget and sell it, considering I believe it's one of the more rare river fish just from its size. Also, we need to check the second floor of the museum because I just want to make sure that the... Uh, I think it's the silver net isn't already there, because I think it might be. We've done a lot of bug catching recently. Okay, so there's that done. Oh my god, it's taller than the both of us. Dear lord, that is a big fish. Alright, so there's that donated. Let's go check upstairs really quickly. Fingers crossed. Nope. Um, and I already have a gold- or not a golden, sorry, a silver shovel, so I really don't need that. Man, I feel like if I just keep visiting every day, it will pop up soon, just because we've donated a lot of bugs. Um, recently in particular, since the summer started, so... As I say, summer nearly ends. Where did summer even go? Where did this year go? Okay. So, next project. Really quickly, gonna go sell all of this stuff in my inventory that I don't need right now. Which is most of it. Um, and then I wanted to start moving some of those red lilies over to beside the police station. A lot of you were saying red lilies and like white lilies or red and white and like I, I'm down for that. I don't think that's a bad idea at all so I'm gonna see what it looks like at least. I'm kind of taking a risk running around at night like that. I probably shouldn't do that. Okay. Uh, I want to sell. Sounds good to me. Getting them bills. <laughs> uh, how much do I have left on my home loan? I just realized maybe we should go put some into that just to wrap up the episode in a minute. That might be an idea. I think I was really close to paying it off actually now that I think about it, so that would be good. Okay, so these right here have just kind of been sitting here for the longest time. I, I don't even remember when I put them here. Although for those who may have been binge watching through the series, you've probably seen it quite recently, so... Okay. Um, so I think I'm just going to go check your pattern for now. It's my go-to for when I don't know what to do with the area, so... I'm also going to make sure to cover behind this tree, just because it's kind of hard to see what's going on back here if I don't. Um, and I think I want to leave this little area open. I kind of like how this four-leaf clover is spawned here. If we can get them to spawn in these other areas as well, that would be awesome, but again, that would be, like, a really long-term project at this rate, so... Um, I don't think we need 
that there, to be honest, considering nothing is gonna move into that spot. Or this spot. Perfect, that actually worked out really well. Snap! <laughs> okay, let's grab some of these white ones here. I feel like I just heard the tarantula or scorpion. I might... I might not have, I might just be hearing things, but... <laughs> Hopefully I'm uh, just hearing things. Okay, and I don't really know what I want to do in this area. You can't actually build anything in there. I tried, um, as you guys may remember, so... If you have any suggestions for cute flower arrangements or something that would fit in that space... That would be nice. Something more than just checker pattern though, because I, I tend to do this and I realize that I tend to do it. Um, and I'd like to break my horrible, horrible cycle. And... Perfect! It looks good, but I feel like there needs to be like some dark in there. Maybe I should throw in like a line of blue or something. I'm not sure. I feel like it needs to be a bit darker though. Okay, let's drop by the post office super quickly. See about that home loan that we still have. Hot! Perfect! Awesome! So we're actually getting that paid off today. Nice! I feel like that's the most productive I've been in a little while. Alright. Well, anyways you guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode, but I do have to end it here. So, thank you guys very, very much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.